What's going on, everybody? I'm Kevin from Prop Style, and I am in my car because I wanted to go over um, uh, the, uh, the my cell phone holder. Yeah, it's kind of cool, so I wanted to kind of create a video on it. Um, as you can see, this one is from Bullet Point Mounting Solutions. Um, I was looking for different cell phone holders. Uh, my, my truck didn't come with the wireless charging pad. I was looking to install one. And then I came across Bullet Point, and I'm like, oh, that looks kind of cool. So I uh, watched uh, um, a couple of videos. This isn't going to be an install video. As you can see, it's already installed. There are hundreds of videos. It's cut and dry, super simple on how to install these. You can watch a, uh, a different video. I'm driving a 2021 uh, GMC 1500 or 1500 elevation. Um, so first of all, everything is super nice. I don't know what I expected. Um, but like all of the boxes, I mean, everything came in separate boxes. Everything is super high end. I know this, this system was like a hundred dollars. I had to pay a little bit more. We'll get into that in a minute. Um, but it comes with absolutely everything you will need. Um, everything's packed in styrofoam. Um, it comes with the, the screwdriver that you'll need. It comes with stickers. It comes with a, uh, a bottle opener that's shaped like a round, not a bullet, because that assembly is a round. A bullet cartridge is a round. Um, everything is super, super nice. Uh, um, good instructions. Um, like I said, I, I did have to go online, uh, or I did go online ahead of time to, uh, uh, to find the um, uh, install videos. The only thing I didn't, and I really wanted to make this video because I really wasn't sure about the motorized cradle and and like nobody has done a video on that that i could find and um and saying if it works or not um so um it does work i'll show you how that works in a second uh this system was like 115 dollars i end up i didn't like the mounting arm that they give you with the stock system because it puts it too high and it runs into the dash, so it kind of tilts it up a little bit. Um, so I end up going back online. I was like $115 for this system, and then like another $35 because I had to buy the adapter and then, or the longer one, and then it comes with the new screw threads. This system should have come with the longer one to begin with. So assembling this, I think somebody maybe made a mistake. It is what it is, um, or, I or I also should have been able, in my opinion, to be able to buy this piece separately without having to buy the other attachments um, as well. Maybe could have saved a little bit of money or you, you know, maybe sell this um, a la carte. If you've got a 21 Silverado or a GMC and your dash is like mine, um, definitely opt for the, well, there's no way to opt. Maybe you can call them up and say, hey, can you swap out the, the, the small arm for the longer arm? And then maybe they can give you some kind of discount. That's what I really would like to see. It's my only um, complaint about the system is that the arm is too short and I couldn't just order the arm. But I will put this arm to good use. Um, either um, uh, my wife... When we're traveling, she doesn't really have to look at her phone. She just likes to have it um, charging and um, or even just up on there. And then she'll listen to a, a podcast or something. So I may, end up, I may end up getting another bracket, putting it on the other side um, and then you know having one for her or a GoPro mount or, or another mount because the, the, it's slotted. So as you can see. Um, it's got lots of room for other styles of mounts. Um, but the one thing I really wanted to make this video and show about was the wireless cradle. And I have been using this for a couple of months. Um, it works. So my, my wife, when she first got in it, she, was, she came back in the, uh, from her uh, trip to the grocery store. I hate that mount. The phone just falls right out. Yeah, you got you to press the button. So there is a button on the side. And it opens and closes pop your phone in and and it holds it rugged now i'm filming on my phone only because i didn't want to bring my dslr out here um, i have the new galaxy s24 
not the Ultra, but uh, uh, the big one, but the Galaxy S24. I got a UAG case on there, and it's the biggest thing that can fit in there. Like, I don't have to cram it in there, but when I put it in there and it, it snaps in snug. Um, oh, does that close automatically? I never, I never realized. Or did I actually hit the button? Oh, it does. Huh. So maybe it's got some kind of sensor there that will automatically sense. I didn't know that. I've been using this, like I said, for a month, more than a month. And I didn't know that it will close automatically. Because normally I just, I just set in there and then one hand did. Whoop. It's, it's my daughter's phone. It's tiny. So, um, and then I just set it in there. Wireless charging works. It's not super fast wireless charging, but it's quick wireless charging. Um, I do like, uh, um, cause any wireless device will get a little bit hot. I do like that it sits right in front of my AC vent. So the AC is on and it kind of cools everything down, um, as it's charging and it's like right there in my line of sight. So if, if I've got the GPS going, um, um, uh, I, well, I can, I have the GPS on the big one, but sometimes I've been in a small area. I'll just plug it in here without just setting it on the, on the big screen. And it's just there that I can look at it. Um, usually at long trips, I'm just, I'm playing a podcast or video, um, and just listening to it, but it's like right there in my periphery. So as I'm driving, I can kind of look over every now and then and just see what's going on on screen. It's not too distracting. It's not in your way. It's not in the way of my gear shifter or anything else. Um, so, and it's perfect. And, and if you want to, to, you can just loosen these up and you can move them back and forth. If you don't like the area that, that it's, that it's in, it's, um, super nice. You can get them per pretty snug. They don't bounce around. Um, yeah, other than that, um, I, I really like it. The motorized part, it works flawlessly every single time. Um, we can see if we can get like a, a close up, a little bit more close up. I'm trying to hold this with an external monitor. Yeah, it just holds it perfectly. So yeah, that's, um, that's it. The bullet point mounting system. Um, it, it works. Um, I, uh, I, I love it. Like I said, uh, the wireless charging works. Oh, I, uh, it did come with like a little trim attachment. Um, I do have it tucked into the trim all the way around, all the way down. And then the cord kind of comes out on the bottom. I didn't have to disassemble anything. And then it just plugs right into to the USB port. I just tuck that, the, the remaining cable underneath. So I didn't have to disassemble any of the trim. I just used the, uh, the, uh, the included plastic trim tool and just tucked it in all the way around. So if you're looking for a good uh, um, uh, uh, cell phone mounting port, and then like I said, they have uh, um, um, camera mounts, GoPro mounts, everything. Uh, go look it up. This isn't a sponsor video. I don't have any kind of affiliate link. So if you click, you know, I'm, I'm not making any money. Um, but when I find something cool, I like to throw it out there um, for everybody else to, uh, to check out um, in case uh, they're looking for the same thing uh, I was looking for. Sorry, cats and kittens. We'll catch you on the flip side.